So here we are with Sheedy's GT350. As you can see, there's so much done to this car. And I think it's fair to say this is the craziest GT350, or at least the craziest one that I've seen. Still stock motor-wise, but the amount of aero that has been put on this car just to increase the amount of grip it has is just insane. Let's go ahead and just take a look at all the modifications on this vehicle. As you can see, we have the Archetype Canards right over here that are all carbon fiber and the massive, massive splitter. Right away, you guys are definitely able to tell it's a unique color scheme done by Vomaro SF, which is a full custom wrap done to the car, which is this military green with orange and white, which looks super, super cool. So it's running Hoosier tires, a 315 square setup front and back with some signature wheels over here. And then if you come over here, you can check it out. The racing seat in the passenger and driver's seat with the half roll cage over here with the racing harnesses. So then coming around to the back of the car, as you can see, this wing is just massive from Archetype Racing. Take a look at that. And then it's top mounted because it's more efficient when it's top mounted like this uh, for the track. So it's just nuts to think that like my GT350 that's over there, it feels crazy already on track, but this thing just has such a huge increased amount of grip. As you can see over here, we have the hood vents put on it. So the hood was all cut up to fit these vents on here with the pins right over here too. And then the stuff that you're not able to see is there's a full Cortex racing suspension on this GT350, fully adjustable coilovers on this vehicle too. And then if you come over to the rotors, you can see these aren't any rotors. These are some special rotors. These are carbon ceramic rotors on a GT350. So there's carbon ceramic brakes on here. And it's just absolutely nuts what has been done to this vehicle. Rear seat delete, two in the back, lots and lots of mods, all to help the handling of the car. So we are gonna get this thing out on track and I'm gonna ride passenger later on in the day. So stay tuned for that video, but this is to go over all the modifications on this GT350. And this is a normal GT350 transformed into this. And it's just crazy to see where you can go from a stock car uh, over to this. And this was all built by the man himself, Trent, over at his shop in Sonoma Raceway. Like I told you guys, the craziest shit comes out of this guy's shop and he does really good work and the fit and finish of this car is just crazy so yeah this thing is definitely something to admire for a while cannot wait to get it out on track let me know what you guys thought of this build down below in the comment section go give the owner a follow right over here Sheedy's gt350 on instagram he has a really cool car collection a gt500 too and a raptor and as you can see that's the sticker right over there for Trent's shop. That's his logo. And then Benny killed it from Bomaro SF with this wrap design. So if you need a wrap, go hit him up on IG. I'll throw it up right over here. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys go check out the video of the track footage of this car. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Are you good? You see a car coo, call the cops, boy. AK all day, body start to drop, boy. Bamba Jinya beat down, Sari Dinya street down. They're trying to lock us up, but we ain't gonna stop, boy. They're trying to lock us up, but we ain't gonna stop, boy. They're trying to lock us up, but we ain't gonna stop.